Okay, so tonight we're getting our first look at the Dallas Police Chief's crime plan. After we saw an increase in violent crime in 2019, Tanya Iser has been digging through the documents today. Tanya, what does the plan say? Well, Chief Hall is setting a crime reduction goal that includes a 5% reduction in violent crime citywide. To do that, she says she'll hire more civilians so police officers can do police work, create a new 100-person officer violent crime task force, task force, although the plan doesn't say where she's going to get that manpower from and enhance the department's data-driven approach. Uh, the mayor, Mayor Eric Johnson, called the plan a start this afternoon, but he was clear that he didn't think it was ambitious enough in its goals. In a statement, he said, we should strive to reduce homicides, aggravated assaults, and robberies to 2018 levels citywide, at least. He says the goal should be to reduce violent crime back to the historic lows the city saw in 2013 and 2014. Uh, today, we also spoke to the presidents of the two, uh, two of the police associations, Terrence Hopkins, a vocal supporter of the chief, and Mike Mata, a vocal critic. So now we do have to start focusing more on the preventive side, and that's what this plan is going to look at doing. I mean, we're talking 26, 27 pages, a whole lot of big words, a whole lot of police jargon, a whole lot of maps, a whole lot of content, but very little clarity. Well, the chief told us in an email that she would not be answering questions about the plan until she addresses the Public Safety Committee next week. All right, Tanya, so how does crime in Dallas compare to other large cities? Well, when you take a look, let's talk about violent crime. The city included, uh, the police included a chart that showed the crime rates, the per capita crime rates of the top 10 cities. And when we figured out the percentages, Dallas has seen a 15% increase in per capita crime. The next city behind us was uh, San Antonio at 6%. So there's a, Dallas was definitely a huge outlier when it comes to violent crime. Wow, crime rates are through the roof. Why did it take the chief so long to come up with a plan? Well, those are questions uh, that we'll obviously have to ask her when she talks to us. And when did she plan to do that? Well, she said that she would address us uh, after she speaks to the Public Safety Committee uh, next week. So uh, we're hoping that she'll sit down with us and provide a, a whole lot more clarity on this plan. Okay, our thanks to Tanya Iser. Both Tanya and the web team did a great breakdown of this report on our website, WFAA.com.